Hi everyone, this is Nikki Rowland and today I have a layout to share for Go Go Shop Away using the beautiful um, American Crafts Jen Hadfield Stardust collection. Um, it's a really lovely collection um, by Jen Hadfield, much brighter than um, than we're usually used to um, from that designer. Um, and um, yeah, I've really, really enjoyed um, using this collection. I've made a few layouts with it already, or quite a few layouts already. Um, and uh, just popping back to it now after a little break um, to make this one. So um, I have um, taken um, a white background and I've got this lovely sheet of pink. It's got these kind of retro looking flowers on the back, but I decided to go for the pink side. So it's a pink diagonal stripe. I've trimmed that down to about 10 by 10 inches. Um, and then I've really distressed the edges of that middle square and um, really kind of roughed them up so they've got lots of uh, texture and dimension. Um, <clears throat> and then I'm going to use this speech bubble paper. So. I, l I really loved these speech bubbles, but I didn't quite know what to do with them. It's a very busy sheet to use as a background or even as a piece. Um, so I just went for the, the obvious option, which was just to cut them out. <laughs> um, I specifically chose um, blues and pinks and also some like creamy colors as well just a couple um and that is to um <clears throat> that's because of the photo that i've got we're all wearing pink aprons with a blue swatch on the front um so therefore the pinks and the blues went really perfectly well with my photo but this would have uh, if you had a multicolored photo the speech bubbles would have been great in the multicolors as well um so um definitely if you've got that paper consider doing that so so yeah, so okay, so I have cut out them all, I've stuck them all down, I've got my photo there and mounted onto a pink piece, of, or a pink journaling card I think. I also cut out some of these um, kind of, ne I think they're kind of neon hearts, um, as in light strip neon, do you know what I mean? Um, there's a whole sheet of those on a navy background with all these different um, concentric hearts on and they remind me of like a light up sign um, so that's why I call them neon hearts they're not very neon actually but um, that's just what they remind me of so um, I've got those in the gaps um, and I've got all my speech bubbles pointing towards my photo and I'm just adding a title with the really lovely um, Jen Hadfield Stardust glittery thickers um, really really um, love those they're on pink foam and they have silver glitter on the top so what's not to love um i love thickers obviously i think everybody does <laughs> um <clears throat> but um so just added that down i had to move some of my speech bubbles out of the way um in order to make my title work but i just moved them um and um closed that gap up that i created um with the uh by removing those two um i didn't waste any <laughs> um okay so now I need to add some other embellishments, but I'm conscious of the fact that this is a very busy layout um, and I don't really want to add in big clusters because um, I'll then cover up the words on the speech bubbles and I just love all the sentiments and the phrases. I, I say I was limited to blue, or I limited myself to blues and pinks, but the words are great. You know, you make me smile, lovely, mind blown, wonderful, what, you are so cute, the best day, special, that was cool, favourite place, you go girl friends for life, true story, best friends, sweet, magical together, hey cute stuff, fun, remember. All really usable generic things. Um, I picked out things about friendship as well because this is a group of friends rather than like love things even though I love you girls loads. <laughs> um, uh, but uh, the friendship things uh, were really apt for this photo. Um, <clears throat> so um, I, I decided not to go for any big embellishments from the Jen Hadfield collection. So instead I had a quick look through my Bramble Fox um, perspectives to see if I had anything that would work. And yes, I had a crafty set. Perfect, because we're away crafting. So um, I used the word crafty, um, the pink tape HEG gun, um, the glue gun, which is kind of in a purpley colour. Um, and then a pair of scissors. So I've just added those in. Even though there's no purple on the layout, um, pink and navy together kind of create purple so I think the purple is not out of place it certainly looks okay in terms terms of tone um so um I just added those in even though officially there is no purple on the layout it definitely goes okay so just adding those in now I'm just going to stick those down um I tend to stick my uh perspectives down with um glossy accents or 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 raise them on foam pads um because obviously there's no flex um <clears throat> in perspectives they're very um 
they're very solid um <laughs> so therefore they can ping off um if not secured very very well so i tend to use um, a good amount of glossy accents uh to kind of sit them in um there we go and that is the layout pretty much complete i just need to write a couple of lines of journaling so um our friend made us all these aprons um and they're just beautiful and they're all you know it's amazing that they've been hand decorated um so uh I had to scrapbook this um, photo, of course, and that's us all lined up wearing them, so amazing. Um, so I'm just gonna finish off now with um, some splatters of white paint. I was going to try and keep the splatters small, but they some of them ended up being quite big. Um, and uh, I'm just trying to keep it quite condensed around the photo rather than spread out over the entire layout. But there we go, that is the layout complete. Um, so I hope um, I have inspired you to look at that speech bubble paper in a different light um it's one that i looked at and thought oh goodness what am i going to do with that love it but what am i going to do with it and fussy cutting was the way forward thank you so very much for joining me today that was nikki Rowland for go go shop away using the jen hadfield stardust collection <laughs>